the Senate and the Executive Department, there's some kind of conflict po dahil doon sa investigasyon ng Blue Ribbon Committee. Um, merong mga nagsasabi na kumbaga si President Duterte daw po parang pinipigilan yung um, pag, pag, uh, pag-transpire nitong investigasyon. Now, if you win... Um, in the Senate, how will you push for an independent Senate, especially if Mayor Isko wins the presidency? How will you do that, Bob? Well, literally, of course, um, is to be the non, uh, non-partisan person that you can be, no? na wala kang binidepend sa pong interes. Mm-hmm. Because I think that's one of the questions right now is, who are we lawyering for? Are we lawyering for these contractors po na formally? Mm-hmm. So, alam ko po na napaka- Emotional po sa amin sa Mindanao itong issue ng health services because I for one uh, know that ma- many of us did not go, were able to reach an ICU or a, get it to silumusub medicine or a residivir. Uh, mm-hmm. The PPEs did not arrive really as up no, from that March lockdown last mm-hmm. year. So talaga pong formally is that a testament na pag wrong uh, implementation or lack of uh, transparency accountability ay pwede pong ano eh it, it denies no it denies the real actual uh, victims or service needed no? for people so i will be the nonpartisan investigative uh, so called part of that investigative power oversight of senate uh, to ask to question um if the families reaches out to me because they need to reason out with me as a senatorial mm-hmm. um with due process for i listen in i listen in but won't be their defender but of course i'll, I'll listen no mm-hmm. i'll listen and i'll also be asserting Mm-hmm. The, the non-negotiability of uh, transparency and uh, compliance to standards for 